Hi everyone, it's Canyon from CanyonHowls.com. Um, I'm back today to do a video of what's in my everyday carry day planner. Um, two weeks ago I did a what's in my bag, a quick look at what's in my bag, and this was one of the items in my bag. This is my everyday carry um, planner. This is a Chic Sparrow um, extra wide traveler's notebook. Um, so we're gonna just jump in and get started and I'll show you uh, the inside, how it's set up and um, the theme that I've got going in it. So here we go. When you open it up, once I get the band off, once you open it up, um, you've got pockets over here, three credit card slides, sized pockets and a big pocket on the back and I've just got some um, Target dollar spot um, notepad in here part of a notepad in here I've got some pictures in here that I took um, on my camera and then printed off with my LG Pogo printer I have these ready tags. I use these for marking important information in my day planner. And then once you come over here, I've got a 12 credit card, 12 pocket credit card holder. And on the top I've got my Canyon Howells um, logo on a business card type photograph that I printed again off of my LG Progo printer. I've got some washi tape on a card in here just a f three things of washi and a picture of my husband when we were hiking up Mill Creek Canyon a few about a month and a half ago you open it up and then here um, so the theme if you haven't noticed is um, safari print I'm going with safari a safari theme in here so everything's safari print or animal printed up here I've got my to donuts um, for marking what gets done. Then this tiger print one is the Midori craft folder. And you open that up and I've got some one point seals right here. Oops, sorry. One point seals, these are for marking important dates in my day planner. And then I've got more stickers over here. I've got some gas ones for marking when I fill up my truck with gas. Um, some other little ones. I'm not even sure where I got these, to be honest with you. Um, some candles. These are my queen bee designs. And then I've got some water tracking ones and some weather stickers that I got in a rack. And those just stay in that this other pocket on the Midori, on the Midori um, craft folder. And then you flip that over, and this is the back side of the 12 pocket credit card holder. And then you flip that over, and this is the very back part of it. And I've got some Target dollar spot page flags in here, just because I think they're cute. Then my first um, insert is this. It's a dashboard that I made out of some scrapbook paper. And you open it up and I'm planning to put some sticky notes and um, page flags on here so that I can use in my planner. Then my first insert is a month on two pages. This is what the tiger print is and then I put this little mountain lion sticker on there. And I've got some of, some of my contact information, which I've just covered up. And then you flip to the month on two pages. Um, and this is what the month on two pages looks like. And I just write down important information on here. Um, the hours that I work each week goes over on this side. So that's the month on two pages. And I just decorate according to the month. That's what November looks like. And you flip that over, and I've got an Ollie clip holding 
um, some of my months together. And this is the back of a dashboard that I made. And this is the back back side of the dashboard. My next insert is another dashboard that I got from Crafty Chi. She made this for me. And it's got some sticky notes, some uh, tiger print sticky notes on it that I used. Obviously, you saw that one that was covering up my private information. And then this insert is a uh, week on two pages with um, an area to check off what you get done that week for the week. And this is just what my week on two pages looks like. And then I use these sticky notes and I'm not gonna flip to them because most of them have important information but I use these sticky flags to mark important information that I need to remember and I use different colors according to what the information is for. So that's my week on two pages and that's the back of the week on two pages. This is the back of the dashboard that was made by Crafty Chi. Then my next insert is my blogging insert and it, I just have a bunch of blog um, posts that I plan to do, some um, blogs that I like to read, stuff like that in here and I'm not going to flip through that because some of that information I don't want you guys to see because it's for upcoming blog posts. And then my next insert is my um, health and fitness tracker. And this I'm just doing, um, keeping track of what I eat. This part hasn't been filled out very well because I've had a hard time the past few weeks remembering what I eat and when I do it because I have my day planner with me at all times at work because of my schedule. So um, up here it was a little bit more filled out. And then I did use the little one of the little stickers to denote what um, weight, what I had done for fitness stuff. So that's my health and fitness tracker. And that's the back of that. This is my journal and I don't have anything even started in here because I just haven't had time to really journal in, in this. But that's what this insert is for. It's got a peacock print on it. Um, and that's the back of that. And then the next insert is for my goals. And again, I don't have anything written down in here because I haven't really had time to go through and write down my goals because I haven't had my day planner with me at all times at work like I'm used to having it. So that's to come. And my final insert is this, and it's my inspirational insert. And it's just where I put mostly logos because I love logo design. So mostly where I put logos and pictures and images that I like. Yeah. Hang on guys, just a sec. Okay guys, sorry about that. Um, so I just put images that I like, logos that I like, things that are, I think are inspirational to help me with my own logo design business and help me give me ideas for designing my own logos. Um, and then this is just my logo design that I had done by somebody else for my Canyon House logo and I printed it in there. So that's my last insert and then back here I've just got a bunch of sticky notes and not sticky notes, stickers and page flags. Um, I've got this from, I don't even know where I got it and it's just got some um, washi tape samples in it. This um, fits the fits the safari theme I'm going with so I've got that in there. Some stickers that I got from I think these came from Annika Hanby if I remember right because I ordered a folder from her for one of my other um, traveler's notebooks. Some safari stickers. Some um, stickers and these are by Mabel's Stables. These are just traveler's notebook stickers. And then these are some typewriter stickers for 
denoting when I do blog posts and I can write on these what I what I'm writing whatever I want so it could be my novel or a short story or whatever I'm working on so those are that that this is the back pocket it's a it's a secretarial pocket and I've got two pen loops on this um, I like my sharpie pen but I've also found I like my Coletto so I'm lucky to have two pen loops so I can carry around my two favorite pens with me at all times and basically that is the look there's my chic sparrow logo on the back of my traveler's notebook in case you're wondering what it looked like so basically that's a brief look at my um, extra wide chic sparrow traveler's notebook that I carry with me on a daily basis so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did like it and give it a thumbs up um, and if you want to see more videos from me go ahead and hit the subscribe button and I'll have some more videos coming up here shortly anyway other than that I'll talk to you guys in my next video thanks bye